Hi everyone, it's me Jenny from your Health Matter channel and in our today's video, we will talk about facts about enlarged prostate every man needs to know. But before we start, please consider to subscribe to our channel so you will not miss our new videos to come. What are the facts about enlarged prostate every man needs to know? Hey guys, we know that talking about your prostate can be a little uncomfortable. You might not know where or what it is, or you might have only heard about it in stories about older men having difficulty peeing or the doctor sticking their finger up, you know where to check on it. Prostate problems in men are difficult to ignore because as AIDS catches up, the gland starts to behave trickily. It increases in size, interferes in too many ways with one's lifestyle, and does not cease to seek attention and rub one's peace of mind. When the gland increases in size, it is referred to as an enlarged prostate. Many people confuse this with prostate cancer and there are several myths surrounding the same. So, in this video today, we talk about some facts on enlarged prostate that every man should know. Fact number one, enlarged prostate is not prostate cancer. The most common misconception people have is that enlarged prostate is a symptom of prostate cancer. However, enlarged prostate and prostate cancer are two different aspects of a man's health and have nothing to do with each other. But both the condition can exist simultaneously. However, it is not necessary that every man who has an enlarged prostate would be suffering from prostate cancer. While prostate cancer is a silent killer and asymptomatic, enlarged prostate show certain symptoms like difficulty in passing urine, weak urine stream, inability to empty the bladder, etc. When a person reaches out to a doctor with symptoms of enlarged prostate and a prostate-specific antigen or PSA test is done routinely, often cancer is detected in most men due to elevated PSA level, not because of an enlarged prostate. This is why every man over 50 years of age should do a PSA test to check for a prostate cancer. Fact number 2. Enlarged prostates can be treated with medicines. Many men think that there are no solutions to the problems that an enlarged prostate possess. However, in reality, problems of the enlarged prostate can be treated effectively with medications. This can help one get on track and save oneself from the constant problems of frequent urination and other nagging symptoms. Fact number 3. After 50 years of age, prostate gland grows in every man. I'm sorry to tell you this guys, but there is no man who can escape this fate. Just like women, who reach menopause after a certain of age, men during andropause or male menopause experience enlargement of the prostate. Usually, when a man reaches a certain age like 55 or 60 years of age, the prostate gland which weighs 18 grams starts to enlarge. However, the variation might depend on one person to other. Some men might have mild enlargement, some might have a severe enlargement. Some might see a 25 gram increase in their gland and some might see 50 gram and in rare cases it can also get enlarged up to 100 gram. On average, 
a man might have the gland increase by 60 gram. Fact number 4 Some enlarged prostate might need surgery. While enlarged prostate can be treated with medication, in some cases, surgery might also be necessary. However, for an enlarged prostate, one does not need to remove the entire prostate. And in fact, laser surgery is done to remove the overgrown part of the prostate with presses on the urinary tract to help them with some relief. So, problems that a man faces due to an enlarged prostate can be treated and managed effectively. Until recently, many doctors encourage yearly PSA testing for all men beginning at age 50 or even earlier for men at high risk of prostate cancer. As doctors have learned more about the benefits and harms of prostate cancer screening, they have begun to caution against annual prostate-specific antigen or PSA testing. You have to talk with your doctor about what is best for you. That's all for today guys. Thank you for watching and I hope that you liked the video and if you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any question, please leave a comment down below. Thank you so much for watching. Let's catch up on the next video coming very soon. And please don't forget to subscribe. Have a nice day everyone.